Hello, this is With Star Skunk Water, and today we're discussing our wayward house, the Bridge of Hope. Um, we are doing an interview today with beautiful Brittany. I consider her my adopted daughter. Um, I'm doing a short interview with her. So, Brittany, how did you become a uh, part of the Bridge of Hope? Well, my boyfriend Randy needed a place to go and Holly took him in and I he ended up getting ill and I ended up staying there off and on and come beginning of December I ended up staying there full time to avoid uh, mental abuse that's been going on with me and my folks. I needed a place to go. Um, what are your chores there at the Bridge of Hope? Um, some light cooking. Uh, dishes and just keep helping keep in the place tidy okay um, here's a question I didn't ask before what improvements do you think we could make on the bridge of hope um, and you always tell me there <laughs> that's um, that's okay it's it, it's okay um, I know you're already getting ready to make improvements but heat Yes, heat would be nice, but um, we do have we do have heat. It's just not sufficient. Yeah, um, we have uh, right now we have a wood burner, but it's not the right one. Yeah. You watch the road. I'm on the camera. I am. <laughs> I am. Um, um, our other wood burner, the blower went bad in it. So right now we're using a wood burner without a blower. Um, things we could always use. Our roof uh, is also partially being done. Uh, the guy that was working on the roof has backed out on that. So now we're going to have to just wait a couple more days, hopefully, to get it done. Um, let's see. Maybe more communication, like working together as a team with the buying food for the house. Like when or each other's food stamps come, like maybe use them one part of the month and then the, the other is the next part of the month and then the next one the end of the month. That is so, a that is a beautiful idea. Thank you for that input. Beautiful idea. Um yes. Uh, okay, um let's see. Do you have anything else to add to this interview? I think Holly is doing an amazing job and she's doing a very good thing for people. She always goes completely out of her way to help anyone out that she can and when she can. And she is always here for me. She has done a lot for me. Counseling. She's counseled me. She's been there for me. She's given me a shoulder to cry on more than once. And. She is just an amazing person. All right, stop before you make me cry. What I would like to say is this has done me far more than it could ever do these people. I, I love these people. I consider them family. And anybody that's been there, anybody that, that has crossed those doors, they are my family. They are, my, they are more than blood to me. Uh, and I thank you very much for watching this interview. Skunk water out. Uh, may your God be with you.